Welcome to Peaceful Streaming. So I'm getting back to the, um, the former Christopher Gray apartment when it was a job and uh, it's now called a model apartment. Um, basically I have a couple different things that I need to finish. Well, a few different things. Um, but I figured I better finish it and free up some, uh, free up some, uh, income. And the other thing is this apartment is so huge that it's like this huge drag on my computer. So I figured I'd, of course, the more items I put in, the worse it is. But, um, I figured I'd better, um, better get it done. Um, I thought I'd start with the dining room, which normally isn't very exciting, uh, to me at least, but I've been meaning to use these chairs for a while. Um, they're from the workshop and I think they're just really fantastic. So I thought that since the rest of the apartment is basically luxurious, but not like formal and stuffy, then, then I don't know the dining room seems to be the one place where you would actually be formal. So I thought I could kind of go a little bit all out with this. Um, the tough thing will be finding a dining table that matches. Um, yeah, this, um, this apartment just like brings my computer to its knees. I probably should go around and start like selling stuff because it's just, I think it's the sheer number of items as well as the size, but I mean, it could be wrong. I don't know for sure. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna go with table because that'll bring up all the workshop stuff I have too. Um, and there's some really fantastic workshop stuff. So I don't remember off the top of my head if I, how many dining tables I've downloaded, subscribed to, but um, so now this one, it's kind of basic. I mean, it's nice. I just don't think it's right for this. It's kind of got the industrial look. That'll be nice for the um, the loft apartment I'm I'm redoing or flipping or whatever. Um, let's see. Um. Okay, so that's console tables. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to furniture since um, I didn't see anything in the workshop. Um, okay, so I think I wanna go by sort price descending. Uh, that's interesting, but... Um, Huh, I don't remember seeing this. Yeah, that looks kind of industrial too. Uh, yeah, the legs are metal. Um, I don't think that's what I'm looking for. I think I'm really looking for a, a wooden dining table. And the glass top to me doesn't really work because it seems kind of, it, it seems kind of casual. Um, maybe that's just me, but let's see about this one. Um, wow, it looks like I need wood that's even darker. You know what I actually need is some lighting. So I can see what I'm doing. Um, I guess I'll grab this one. Wow, there are just some areas that that seem to just absorb the light. I don't know if it's the windows or... So what color? I thought it was lighter than that. It is like Burn Beach. It just, the Burn Beach seemed a lot lighter. Um, I'm going to turn off the music because I think it's... It's... um having some trouble. 
Yeah, I don't know what's going on. I was fine this morning in the game. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. I was fine. Um, I like the music, but... Um, and then this afternoon, I'm not doing as well. So I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, Blackwood, no. So Burn Beach is pretty dark. But it's weird. It's... It's... That's a weird table. Okay, so that's not what I'm looking for. Um, now this is, uh, that doesn't, I don't know. I don't see it, but maybe. I don't think there's a really good color. I was, I was thinking more, you know, like, gold utensils and stuff like that instead of now brazil nut burn beach hopefully it comes out a little darker so what 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 is going on here let me bring one of these into a strong light and see if i'm just missing something okay i mean it doesn't look that dark I don't know. Hmm. Okay. I thought, see, I thought Burn Beach was really dark. Am I just, like, wrong? Of course, this would probably solve the problem. Um. Okay, so we could get Brass legs or gold, I guess. Beige. The not as bright gold, um, brown granite. I'm not jumping up and down about any of these so far. Brownish granite. I'm not gonna leave the floor that way by by the way, it is not gonna be the same um So, so this is not going to be the same color. Um, okay, those 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 chairs are killing me. They are really dark. So maybe I need to go with a oh dark color dining table. It's a little plain, and wow, I did not anticipate this being difficult. Oh, now we're down to the really cheap tables. Wonderful. Um, <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> um, let's see. Okay, so I'll look at this one. It's, let's see. Okay, so Brazil Nut Burn Beach. Sometimes the, the colors vary in between. Okay, so that is very light. The Burn Beach. You know what? I'm just going to suck it up and go with the Burn Beach. Um, it looks fine when you look at the top part. It's the legs that look really dark. Are they actually like a different wood? No. Okay. So we'll just, but we're going to go with this. Um, okay. If I stand in the way, then it's a little hard to do this. Um, uh, okay, so I think that's good. What I was going to do is probably put a sideboard here. I would like to do some kind of, I don't know, barrier at the, maybe it is too. Well, I guess the question is, where do I want to put the bar? The bar kind of belongs in the living room, right? Uh, or in between. Actually, maybe I'll put the bar here. Okay, so then that would solve that problem. Um, let's put it, pull it down a little more. Well, and what's nice is that the chairs fit at the table, which is frequently an issue. Um, let's 
let's see. <laughs> Here's a chair. Um, so I think, uh, so the marble floors are going to go. Those are not cozy. Um, I think what I should do is choose one wood for the whole, um, for the whole floor, except possibly the other end, um, maybe white carpeting. I don't know. We'll see. Um, okay. So, so I am going to include the, I really, I really need to, I really need some kind of, some kind of barrier there. I think I'm going to put up a, a lintel because it's, it's bothering me that it really looks like, um, I mean, it looks like one room. Can I not, how close can I put it to the window? Not very. Um, okay. Let's start over here then, I guess. Uh, I, I'm having a lot of trouble like figuring out where. Okay. Okay, so I think it would be there. Okay. Um, let's see. And I think I am going to enclose that, that side of the kitchen the way I started. But, um, for right now, oh, for crying out loud. For right now, um, I just want to look at it from the, the dining room point of view. So, um. Okay, um, oh God, I don't know what it is. I think just because, um, it's very choppy, my gameplay right now, because for whatever reason, I guess because I keep putting more and more things in this huge space and making it worse and worse on my computer. Um, okay. Um, let's put a couple, oh, I keep forgetting it's not a, it does help me at least mentally to separate the rooms. Oh, stop. Okay, so I, I can't do it all the way over there, but for right now, that helps me a lot. Um, I think I'm going to actually start the wood one or two in. Um, yeah, actually, I might start it here. Okay, so yeah. Um, I like having made decisions. It makes me feel better. Um, floor, floor panels. Okay, so now here is the... The difficult decision. Um, it has to be something fairly unobtrusive because otherwise it's just, you know, it's not going to go with everything. Um, I think, so this, okay, so I, I know and I like that one, but I think it might be too dark. So, um, this is very... Try to remember. There's some of these that are extremely matte. I mean, they look like really like that. I do not like that. Um, it looks all shiny in the preview, and then, um, and then you put it down, and it's like, eh, that's a little. I think the pattern is too strong. Um, it's it is nice and shiny. This is very light, but that's not going to work in here. Maybe. Hmm. Maybe what I should do. Oh. Maybe what I should do is just do this and here and worry about then like the other part. I'll I'll start. Um 
I mean, I can always change the floor if it's like really horrible. But um, I mean, this is a fairly dark table. They're dark chairs, at least partially. That looks, that's weird. That look, looks a lot more matte than I remember too. Well, as I said, I always change it. Well, actually I should see how it looks so far. Um, it's darker than the table. Okay. Um, I was just going for what I knew, which is not a good excuse. Okay, wait a minute, I tried that one. Um, uh, what does this look like? I'm like, oh no, these are the really rough ones that you can actually see the planks. So that's a no. Um, this one is kind of extreme too, I think, right? Oh, wow. Yeah, that's like cherry wood and stuff. No, that's that's a very definite look. Hey, Lua. Um, oh, the, the dark one or uh, your favorite floor is the dark one that I was using? Because I'm I'm like probably a couple minutes behind you here. Um, this that doesn't look like brown, does it? No, that is, no, that's interesting, but I guess I haven't used that. That's really strange. If that's not brown. I'm not really sure how they can say brown. Okay, so this is, yeah, this is the one I really like, this herringbone. Um, shoot. I, this, I do run into this a lot because there isn't one I really love. And so that's problematic. Um, I love this. These end up, I think this ends up looking kind of gray too. Okay, I'm just like, um, okay, I'm going to, oh, wait a minute. Is that the one I just tried? It would be, it's the pro one of the big problems is they do not look like their previews. That's way too late. Um, uh, this is one thing I get very frustrated about. Okay, I think this is the one that's the, like got the real pattern. I'm just going with that for now, I have to say. Because uh, I get the feeling I'm not going to really... I mean, I know what's what's available, and that's the problem because I, I just there are not enough good options for um for the wood floor. There just really aren't. I mean, this in a way, it would be a good floor for the whole room because um, it's, uh, I mean, it's got light and dark. I don't know. That might be actually a good way to look at it. Um, oh, wow. That was fun. What is just, this is just killing my computer. I think I'm going to have to, after I, after I end the stream, I think I'm going to have to go and delete stuff from some of the rooms because this is just really, yeah, um, this is really killing my computer. Um, so this is not exactly how I would want to do that, but that's another argument. Actually that I like that. Um, it's another argument for, um, using it on the entire floor. I think it would look nice. Um, but anyway, so we're just dealing with this for now. Now the sideboard, uh, okay. Um, there's some really nice uh, workshop ones, but I'm not sure there are any that are the right color. So I may have to go with console. What do I have on my hand? Do I still have cake on my hand? Or frosting. 
Oh, God, what? There's something on my mouth. I am just... I'm so bad. I, I, like, eat at my desk. My son cleaned my, um, my keyboard one time, and he was like, what do you do with this? And I was like, well, you know, I eat at my desk a lot. And he was just like, I just don't understand how you can get so much food and crumbs in here. And I was like, well, um, I guess it's a gift. Uh, let's see. I, uh, that's too light. I used this one in that loft yesterday, I think. Or this console. Um, have I tried this one? This is going to be tough. Um, okay, so I think I need something a little less rustic, though, anyway. Um, now this is nice. It's not, I mean, it looks like a table, so it's not really going to have much of an impact on the room. Um, let's see the industrial one I like, but it just doesn't work here. This one looks fairly plain. Um, uh, it's nice though. That is really nice. Okay. So even if we have to use two, two, um, cause it's fairly small, like use one here and maybe, maybe, or over here, I'm having a thought, but it just is, it's, it's being elusive. Um, so here's the problem I always run into. So I need a rug. Now I'm going to have to probably take all this stuff out again. Okay, so this time I, well, I need one of the dove, dove rugs because I need a large one. Okay, that was good. Um, wow, okay, so I have to remember that those chairs are a fair, fairly detailed pattern. Um, so I don't want to go nuts. Um, Huh. I may not. I wonder if I don't have anything. What about this? Um, it's probably too light. Although it's a nice contrast. Not quite. I really need something more, more formal. Um, now, the ones that come with a game, they're not really big. But you know what? I just thought of something. I think there might be a game rug that, okay, let me try this one just for the heck of it. No, I don't think. Like close, but not quite. It's too pink. Um, I'm thinking that there is a, let's see, floor. Um, see either this one. Oh, this only comes in one size. That's not a problem. Okay, so that's too small. Um, but there is also these. I'm thinking like this one, maybe. I mean, obviously, it's not going to match. I'm not trying to make a match, but maybe the other one. Um, no, that doesn't match as well. So now it's just too much pattern. I love this rug, but no. Um, I do have another thought. I wonder if carpeting would look good in here, if there's anything that actually would look good. I'm not a huge fan of the wall-to-wall -wall carpeting the game has. I mean, it looks very industrial. Okay, so that's not gonna be it. Let's look, let's do a search for carpet. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Um, we just don't have a lot in the way of really elegant rugs. Um, sadly. I think I'm, I'm going to have to go with one of the Dove ones, even if it doesn't match perfectly, because um, uh, there are the RH ones are nice, but I think they're too small. Um, 
So this is, it's probably too light. Yeah. This is not going to be easy. Um, that looks too pink. What about this one? No, I think I might go with um, the one that, that I tried initially that's really light. Um, that the one at the bottom there. Because th there, there isn't a lot of brown. That's kind of green. Um, and most of them are barely light. So I'm just going to look at a couple more of them, the ones that were down here that I really didn't pay much attention to. That's very green. Of course, the chairs are kind of greenish yellow. Huh. Now, I'm in the way, so it won't. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to stand over here and try that again. <laughs> Okay, so it wasn't just me being in the way. It is that I have to move everything. God, that's such a pain. They're playing musical chairs. Um, God. So as I said, I think I'm going to do where possible do a lot of gold in this room. I guess I'm not really off to a good start. That's a fairly pale gold, but still. Um, okay, so is that too green? Oh, now that's just that the table's in the way. Okay, there, stay there. Um, is this too green? It's very green. And those are really yellow. Ugh. Um, it this is my OCD. I apologize. I it like makes me so picky about colors going together. Um, but I'm not gonna. That's really pretty, but it's not the right one. Um, okay, so I'm gonna just suck it up and <laughs> and pick one because uh, I think it's gonna be the Dove Rug Dove Rug Ten. Um, and what about? Okay, so this is really kind of wild. No, okay. I have used that one before, haven't I? I think I used, or I used something similar in the, um, where's, where'd tank go? Um, in one of the apocalypse flipper ones. Now, I don't think this is like a perfect match, but I think it coordinates well enough. Not perfectly, absolutely not. But I'm not gonna like spend 20 minutes finding the rug because I mean, honestly, that would drive me nuts. So I can't imagine it wouldn't drive anyone else nuts. Um, I mean, that would drive me nuts if I wasn't me <laughs> with OCD. Um, oh, God, that bothers me. Shoot. And I, I, I happen to know that there aren't any... I have like almost, let me look for, let me look at the RH rugs. I mean, they're smaller, but they're not tiny. So, um, oh God, I love this rug so much. Um, what about this one? No, that's very gray, but, um, let's see. What about this one? That's also gray. Okay. Um, I 
I, I like I'll end up looking at all of them and then I can just look at what I have in front of me because it'll be like this is the stuff that you've been looking at um did I look at eight already yeah okay so you know what I'm gonna go with one of the dark RH rugs I'm um like this I'm gonna go with a really dark one okay so I'm gonna go with the one that's almost black the back of the chairs are kind of that gold and black so um this one is very yeah let's go with this um it's only going to partially show anyway so um i mean i think the the things that are eye-catching are the chairs oops i got a little turned around there um, I mean, I don't love this and I probably will go back after the stream and try every single carpet that I have. <laughs> um, but then I'll only drive myself crazy. So I think that's a good plan. I, I definitely don't love it, but it's, I've reached the end of my rope as far as looking at them right now. So I want a really spectacular chandelier. And unfortunately, this is a low ceiling because the really spectacular ones are um, pretty long or tall or however you would say that. Um, I think what I might, well, I think what I might do, well, okay, no. Um, see, what we really need, look, the back of those is like this, this, it is kind of olive, isn't it? Um, it's like a brown olive. So, um, yeah, I'll probably end up changing the thing. <laughs> okay, so let's look at like really spectacular ceiling lights. Let's go with price descending. Um, we're not using the webway. This is not the right style and, not, and we have it elsewhere. Um, hmm. We need, we need some more spectacular. Now this one I love, but I'm sure the ceiling's too low for it. Right? Yeah, I mean, people would like be bumping their heads. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to let it go. Um... I do really love that one. It wouldn't be in that color. It would be in like a... I am trying to let it go. Um, that's too low, right? Eloa, yeah, I do. I also love the, I don't know how to pronounce it, Noct, Noctis, Noct, I have no idea. But I really wanted to do something formal. Um, I've been dying. You know which one I've been dying to use is, where is it? Okay, did I pass it by? It's got to be expensive. What's the deal here? Wait. Okay. What? Where? Okay, so what, I, I missed it, obviously. I'm going to resort. Um, this one. I want, I want to use this one so badly. I mean, but, <laughs> you know, I mean, I, I really love that one. I, I will probably never get to use that because the problem is, like, if I put it up, if I put on the ceiling, um, I'm pointing at the monitor. Of course, no one can see my finger. I keep forgetting that stuff. Um, so, um, oh, wow, my computer's really having trouble with this. So if I put it up there, the problem, <gasps> no, something changed. Oh, no, wait a minute. Okay, I see. I see. Uh, wow, my computer is choking because it is trying to encompass this whole 
area with all the stuff in it. So I'm going to go back to this area, which doesn't seem to be doing that as much. So I do agree about the, I do agree about these. Um, I just, I don't want the frou-frou chandelier, the Celestes or whatever. Um, now what about, if this was in gold, would it look really interesting? I guess not. I'm probably wrong. No. Well, that's, that's a tiny one. Okay. So if we did like two of these, it doesn't, well, oh, okay. So I inadvertently hit that. I don't know. It's kind of short. That's weird. Um, it says the hanging long diamond lamp. So I guess it's not really, really long. Okay. What about now? I know I use these all the time, but yeah, those look, those are, those are really not sophisticated. I mean, they're like in between sophisticated and not sophisticated. I don't suppose we can get this in gold. Oh, we can get it in white and gold. That's not really the best color. Yeah. Okay. So that's not going to work. Um, what about this one in gold? Okay. That actually, I really like, I do like the other one though. I think I'm going to move it over here. So I don't forget about it. Um, okay. So that's a yellow gold. Does it come in the, in like, what does the beige look like? Oh, there is no beige. <sighs> Crud. Um, sometimes the pink looks, no, it looks bad there. Um, <laughs> um, oh, the, the, um, oh yeah, the, the, what is that one called? The one that I, I could not, the, di, what, they make these names so difficult. Div it, I can't pronounce it. D I V I T I A E. Um, I want I want to use that one so much. Now these I used in the kitchen. In the I don't even know what to call it. The Marie Antoinette. Actually, these these might um. Actually, I think these look good. Those work better than. Where am I putting this? I don't know. Put you over here. Um, th those actually, I think, work. I wish they were a little lower, but now, of course, they, the ceiling's too high. You know, for the other one, it's too low. Um, yeah, and I mean, after all, the overhead lighting is not really what you're supposed to be focusing on. Well, I don't know, my family, my, my mom had candles on the table as often as possible and then would turn off the other lights. But, um, I don't know, is that something everyone does? No, she just liked the atmosphere. Um, okay, so, um, I don't like, what do you, what furniture do you put in a dining room? In my, in my family, we had antiques because that's what was cheap when my parents got married. Like everyone in the sixties, everyone was, um, doing, um, everyone was doing, um, the modern furniture. So, uh, antiques were really cheap. Like no one, no one was into them. So, uh, so we had a lot of antiques plus my my father's family, his father was a, um, a foreign correspondent for Life magazine. So they lived in China for a while. And so we have some Chinese um, antiques and furniture. So um, I'm just used to like nothing matching, if you know what I mean. Now the problem with these big windows is... Um, yeah, so I'm just used to like random furniture here and there. So we didn't have like 
furniture sets um, where you could say, oh, this is for the that, this is for that. Um, you know, uh, we just had like very random stuff. So um, I actually don't know. We we had a sideboard. That's we had. Let's see. We had the table, the chairs. It was part of the living room. It was actually pretty small. Table, chairs, and um, the sideboard, and that was it. So I don't even actually know what goes in a dining room. Um, I mean, we weren't exactly a fancy, fancy kind of family. Um, so I've looked at the consoles. I've looked at the sideboards. I think, um, actually, I, oh, I know what I'm going to do. Okay, so on this sideboard, we are going to put some, I kind of wish it was bigger. Does that one have a, another piece with it? The Vin, Vinator? I don't think it does, actually. Oh, it does. It's a cabinet. Okay, so I totally forgot that it's cabinets. It's not, it's not, I mean, there are multiple names for things. Okay, so that's better. Um, okay, so this is, I'm going to put... Um, serving dishes and um, let's see accessories kitchen um, let's see we have terrines I guess we'll go with the gold ones um, yeah and plates or that we'll put the serving stuff on the side um and then, is that backward? No, it's the same on both sides. Okay. Um, let's see. Terrine. What do you use terrines for? Soup, I guess. Gravy dish. I actually know what that is for. Um, I'm just going to search for Umbra. Uh, let's see. Plates. Well, I'm going to put the plates on the table, I think. Oh, a platter. So that's goes on the on the sideboard too. Um, okay, so hmm. Placemats. Do we have any fancy? I mean, I use the napkins. I don't we don't have any place. Well, let's see. We don't we don't yeah, we don't. I don't know why I'm searching because I already know the answer. Nah. Um, uh, do we have different colors in this? We do. Brown. <laughs> yeah, not really a color. Um, oh, wow. We have even fewer napkins than I realized. Um, so maybe there's a nice grassy yeah that wouldn't work um uh cream uh cream is acceptable that actually oh no it's not acceptable okay so i i need to use a dark one shoot what does this come in um dark green yellow this is going to be one of those i need to just suck it up and find one again i can tell um, okay, so these are just stripes. Sometimes they have different patterns. Oh, no, wait a minute. Okay, so this would be nice if it were in the right color. Uh, so that would be a no. Um, shoot. Okay, what about this? Is this in a nice color? Oh my god, where do these colors come from? Um, does the dark gray work at all? It's not horrible, but that's not exactly a ringing endorsement. Um, oh my God, we need placemats so badly. Um, and these are like all the same color, just different, different patterns. So I'm just, I'm screwed. Um, okay, so, so my best bet I think is one of these. 
Um, I think that's one possibility. The brown was very light, wasn't it? I don't even remember. Dark brown. Okay. I mean, dark brown on... Uh, yeah, but you, once I start putting stuff on here, you won't see it. Uh, I think I just really nailed myself when I chose these chairs. I love them, but um, they're not a workshop item, but they're not placemats. They're napkins. <laughs> I was very sneaky. Um, I just use the napkins because they're not folded, which is kind of weird to me. Um, so they're not folded. So I just use them as placemats because we don't have placemats. And I don't know, is that is that a US thing? I don't know. Um, I know that I know the devs are not in the US. So I don't know. I'm ignorant. It's been a long time since I've been anywhere. <laughs> so I don't know. Um, So I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe, maybe um, people in the U.S. are the only weirdos who do this. I have no idea. Um, or maybe they just figured people would use these as placemats. And so why not? But to me, a napkin is like, yeah, that's a napkin, but you would generally have it folded. So I don't know. I don't want to, I don't want to say they're doing it wrong because who am I to say they're doing it wrong? Um, Anyway, but it would be nice to have, I, I would assume tablecloths would be incredibly difficult. Um, so yeah, I mean, I totally understand why there are no um, tablecloths, but um, the, uh, um, some placemats would be really nice. Oh, these are big plates, aren't they? Oh, I can, it's like doesn't place any. It doesn't center well. Okay, I'm just going to go with this. I have to, like my OCD, I I'm, I try to rein it in when I'm streaming. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> um, it's just not easy. Uh, I But I'm trying. I really am. Let's see. And you know there's no way, if I want to change the rug now, like when I go off stream, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to take everything off the table. Okay, so that's probably not going to happen then because, no. Let's see. Um, so what are the prettiest utensils we have? Oh, no, we can't do that. We have to go by fork, knife, spoon. I forgot. Um, I guess... Fork of Damascus, the RT or Fork of Damascus steel? That one looks a little cheaper. I guess there's not much difference, but um, so what does the gold look like? Okay, so the gold looks nice. I was doing this, I was, I was doing a table in-house flipper. When was it? It was, it was, I think the winter house, the, um, the ski house. And it has been so long since I actually set a table. I could not remember like where, which one on the outside, the knife or the spoon. That was kind of embarrassing. Um, we don't eat at our dining table because unfortunately it's really hard on my back because I have uh, I have ruptured discs, herniated discs in my um in my lower back and my neck. And there's something about the dining table chairs that just really um, are really painful for me. So um, so we like never use them. We like eat in the living room. Um, so I just, it had been so long. And of course with the pandemic, I mean, you know, uh, I assume that I, I hope at least without the pandemic we would have had people over for dinner in the last couple of years um uh we yeah i mean we we probably would have hosted 
like either Thanksgiving or Christmas at our home at least once, I would think, probably. But what happens with my family is my mom is always like, yeah, I'm just, I, I don't feel like hosting, you know, they have the biggest place. And we're all like, yeah, okay, that's totally understandable. I mean, she's 85. Um, so sure, we, we're all like, oh yeah, we under totally understand. And then half the time what happens is then she changes her mind. So like either I or one of my sisters are like, yeah, we'll have it at our house. And then my mom won't be like, she'll start realizing how much smaller our houses are than theirs, <laughs> I think. And, and be like, hmm, uh, maybe we'll have it at our house after all. And my, and honestly, my dad's the one who does the cleanup. <laughs> He's like, before, practically before dinner is done, he'll be, he'll be up like doing the dishes and these things just do not go exactly where you want them to. Um, so I don't know. My mom probably goes nuts over the cleaning ahead of time, but, um, <laughs> yeah, you know, I rarely set it in a house flipper because this is like, I mean, this, this is time consuming. I don't mind it, but it's, I have had on more than one time where I, where I'd be like, okay, tables all set, like six, six places and all the silverware and and then I'm like oh no I forgot something and you know like like I need to move everything and and I just that's just not gonna happen um okay so even though I can't line them up exactly how I want it that still came out pretty well so the only candelabra we have is like I can't, okay, so is it called a candelabra? Uh, okay, candlestick. Does it come in gold? No, yes, okay. Is it the right, oh, that is nice, okay. It's a. It's uh, pretty close. No, I don't, oh, do these, these light? No way, I mean, granted, it's not like, <laughs> it's, it's a little weak, but that's okay. Um, yeah. Um, I, f I don't like empty space, so I'm a little dis disconcerted with how much room there is. Um, okay, I'm not going to worry about it. I'm going to let it go. Um, so I guess... Okay, so what I'm going to do over here is I'm going to put... I'm going to make this like a mini bar because um, I have to say it is so much fun because I don't really drink much anymore to, for me to put like the bottles of alcohol out. I know that's it's like I'm easily amused. So and then we have cocktail shaker and I mean, I don't know, like I think I was talking about yesterday. I grew up maybe it was the day before I grew up in a really rich town, even though we weren't rich. My parents moved there so that we could have the benefit of the school system, which probably was as good as a lot of private schools. So I grew up with a lot of rich people. And um, so this is definitely something that they would have had, like multiple areas in the house to have alcohol because I, obviously I used to, wow, that's like glowing. Is that supposed to be glowing? Um, um, you know, I, I would go to parties and go over to people's houses for dinner and stuff like that. So, um, uh, so I saw like all these really nice houses with like, um, like these were all people who, it was right near New York. So they were, um, generally people who worked in like hedge funds and, you know, um, banks and all that stuff, money managers and God only knows how they made their money. Um, probably like looting the land, being robber barons. Um, let's see, tequila, vodka, rum. See, this is how long it's been. Tequila, vodka, rum. Oh my God, scotch, scotch. Okay, that's actually my favorite. Um, I'm just, that's just sad. I actually have a bottle of scotch that my husband, I asked my husband to get me for Christmas a couple of years ago and it's like three quarters full. I really like scotch, but I have a very low tolerance now. Um, uh, let's see. No vodka, just the rum, please. I know. I um I when I was 
uh, young and carefree. I used to drink um, vodka because it would give me less of a hangover the next day. Um, so that's that's why I used to um, that's why I used to drink vodka. I didn't like it. I'd have it with like grapefruit juice or you know other stuff. So yeah, no. And um, also my friend who I'd go out with, she would get really, really, really drunk. And so I had, I frequently had to um, drive her, let's see. I think what we'd usually do is that I would, don't ask me why, I guess for some reason, oh, she liked driving her mom's car when she came out from the city. Her mom had a Mercedes-Benz sports car. And so, which was all fun. I thought it was a fun car and everything. But then nine times out of 10, she would get roaring drunk and I would have to drive, which made me unbelievably nervous, as you can imagine. I, don't, I have no idea how much the car was worth. I didn't want to know. Um, but so I would end up, um, I would end up driving uh, on the highway. And generally telling her, she'd be babbling because she was so drunk. And I'd generally be telling her, please shut up because I'm driving your mother's incredibly expensive car. car, And I'd like not to crash it. So please be quiet. Um, so yeah, anyway. So I got all this exposure to people with a lot of money. But um, uh, what it basically did is told me that um, money does not make you happy. It may help. Uh, it's nice to have enough to pay the bills and go on vacation once in a while, but, um, the money itself is, is not gonna make you happy. So, um, yeah. And I think actually years later, I still believe that's the case. Um, okay. So, I think we need plants. What's the thing I usually for, I usually do all the time and I haven't been using recently? There's something. And I don't remember what it is. Huh. Well, I wonder if we have a really stunning... I think I already know the answer to this. But like standing light. Probably not. One that would actually go with this room. Um, oh, wait a minute. Floor lamps. Well, I could try this. It's not too far off from the, from that. So let's see about that. It, yeah, most of these don't throw any much light at all. I mean, you really have to actually ask yourself, ask, ask yourself if they're on. Now, I just thought of something. Um... We don't have blinds. We have cloth blinds, don't we? We don't have anything fancy. Um, now, okay, so this, I am just gonna think about this. Would I actually use, probably not. I mean, I wouldn't do pastel, obviously. Oh, you can't do right and left because there are too many windows. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna leave the windows as they are. No, it's not cloth blinds, it's clotho blinds or whatever. Okay, okay, so we're going to skip that. Plants. Um, let's see. How, I didn't notice. How big are these? Oh, wow. I actually have one of those on as a tattoo on my, on my arm. So, wow, those, those are big. That's really cool. Um, uh, okay. So plants, large. Okay, so this is probably a good one. Um, let's do white with a gold frame, I guess. Um... Uh, 
Oh, wow. Is that? Oh, the leaves are so dark. That's why it looks so dark. Okay. I was like, wow, that's dark. It is dark over here, but uh, the problem is mainly the leaves. I do need some more halogens, definitely. Um... Um, okay, so I think I'll stop there with the halogens. Um, this one, I don't know. Let's just do, uh, do that. Um, uh, okay, so we still need more plants. Oh, what I did this afternoon is I flipped like five of the really boring small houses to make money. Um, so yeah, they were boring. And I actually did learn a lot about, this color is so light. I learned a lot about um, like catering to the, eh, catering to the potential buyers. So I looked up what their preferences are and stuff like that. So, um, which isn't so bad. Like I had always felt that if you cater to one, you pissed off the other, but I did realize that what happens is then you, you really, you, um, two or three are the top contenders essentially. And so they're not going to, um, it's not going to change a whole lot unless you do something drastic. So you just have to modify things a little bit to make, um, to make them happy. Now this, you know what I think would be good here. Do we have a nice table lamp? Um, let's see. Of course, I know what I normally do and I can't do it here is mirrors. Can't do it. Um, and the other thing we don't have is really formal, like plant or flower arrangements. So, now there's that, wait a minute, there is one, uh, this one's huge, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's pretty big. Um, I think actually though here, if so I'll do the thing golden. I think here it would be good. Um, okay, I'm gonna swap these. I do like this, but it's, I'd rather put it not hidden but tucked away a little because it is pretty uh strident um i think this actually works better over here um Okay, so I would, oh no, you know what we need? We need like a nice vase. Do I have a nice vase? Like one that's really formal? That's a good question. Um, Cause I don't tend to go for the formal stuff. So I don't pick up a lot of stuff like that. Uh, how about, this is one I do like. Um, I'd like the gold to be a little more yellow, but I don't, this is tiny. I'm kind of surprised that wine rack is, is really tiny. I think, um, I think that's it. Um, yeah, I mean, I think that's it. Um, what time is it? Okay. So it's still pretty early. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a break and then I'm going to continue the Jessica's fabulous mansion. Um, I think probably the kitchen. Um, 
probably. Because I remember the front hall being kind of a nightmare. And maybe I'm remembering wrong. Was I able to get a student to buy the house? Oh, the student? The student was not a top contender in any of the houses. <coughs> um, didn't even get close. There was uh, one or two I think I sold to the business guy. He's pretty easy, um, relatively speaking. Then there was a house that was like, clearly had been owned by a gamer, possibly someone who was like a professional gamer. Um, and so that went to the guy who likes all the technical stuff, obviously. And then, then I sold one to the, the couple, not the, the family. And I sold one to the older couple. Um, but one thing that was frustrating is, is the one I sold to the couple who were like, you know, potentially gonna, gonna have kids. Um, I followed the instructions for what a family room was considered to be, and it didn't work. They, one of the negatives was like, we really need somewhere where our whole family can meet. So I was like, wait, I did everything I was supposed to, but, but apparently there are some quirks with that whole, uh, the whole, you know, um, way of doing things. So that, yeah, that was kind of disappointing. But um, anyway, so I'm going to um, end the stream and take a break and then be back in a little bit. Um, I have tomorrow off, so I don't want to stay up late. Oh, I have to stay up late because our son's not going to be home till midnight. So I guess I'm not going to be in a huge hurry to go to bed. But um, anyway, so I will be back and add a bunny and a ball to the living room. Okay, so I added... Um, I added... Maybe I didn't, I sh maybe I should have done the bunny. I did just like, I, I was very literal. I just put in like a block for the kid's toy. Um, yeah. So yeah, that's a problem. I'm very, very literal. Sometimes I, it, when it says a toy, I was like, okay, here's a block there. That's <laughs> so, yeah. I mean that, that probably was, that was probably, I probably needed to do. I should have just done more, but I was like, it, I think that was like the fourth or fifth house. And I was like, okay, fine. I'm done. <laughs> it's the stand up bunny, not the funky color one. The one that's brown and like his ear droops, like one of the ear droops, I think. Um, uh, I don't remember his name, but he looks, yeah. I mean, he looks a little bit like um, the Velveteen Rabbit. No, no. The Velveteen Rabbit was different. Okay. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Only the bunny and the ball work. Okay, thanks for letting me know because I was very frustrated. Um, that's very specific. They probably should. Yeah, well, whatever. Um, <laughs> yeah, the one ear dropping, yeah. <laughs> okay, so, um, so I'm going to be back in a bit. I am really trying to not change the rug in this. Um, I don't think there's one that's, there is one that's better. What am I saying? Okay. I'll do it later. Um, anyway, so Eloa, thanks for stopping by and maybe I'll see you a little later. And for everyone else, thank you for stopping by. Um, and uh, of course, also the people who are watching the VOD. I really appreciate you guys so much. Uh, really, really do. It's so much more fun to um, do this when I'm not alone. So.